Hey, this is Chris Rourke. I'm the managing editor at Star Local Media Newspapers. Uh, this week's Lake Cities preview is brought to you by the Lake Cities 4th of July celebration and parade, which is set for 9 a.m. on July 4th. Uh, be sure to check out this Sunday's issue of the Lake City Sun. Um, we'll have a story about a uh, set of donations that were recently uh, given by the Denton County Friends of the Family. Uh, also talk about how North Texas uh, Tollway Authority is going up on their toll rates coming up later this summer. And we'll also have a story about a, uh, a Denton County woman whose art she hopes uh, sparks an open discussion about gun violence um, across the country. So be sure to check out this weekend's issue of the Lake City Sun. Today's preview is brought to you by the Lake City's 4th of July, presented by classic Chrysler Jeep Dodge Mazda. The July 4th festivities begin with a patriotic parade at 9 a.m. and features a performance by 1100 Springs from 7 p.m. to 9 p.m. And the day is brought to a close with one of the largest, most dazzling fireworks displays in the area. So come join us for a spectacular, one-of-a-kind celebration that unites the communities of Lake Dallas, Corinth, Hickory Creek, and Shady Shores. Hey guys, this is Tim Glaze, sports reporter with the Lake City Sun newspaper. Uh, I'll be going over this week's lineup of stories that you can find on our Sunday edition of the newspaper. Um, we continue our look at 14 5A sports from the past year and the upcoming year with our 14 5A question series. Uh, we'll also take a look at the third week of Lake Dallas 7-on-7 seven seven football uh, as they competed again last weekend. And then we'll also take a look at the all-district members of this past year's softball team. Again, you can check us out at starlocalsports.com. You can also follow me on Twitter at, at Timothy Glaze.